Uh, quick update. Um, I ended up having to uh, connect a uh, floodlight to the system to be able to keep uh, the load on so I wouldn't have to dump it all the time. So you can see it's quiet now. Uh, but I ended up having to add a uh, battery uh, uh, to put on their charge as well as a floodlight to give the system sufficient uh, load so it wouldn't dump uh, power out. As you can see, the voltage right now uh, is about, well, it fluctuates, but uh, the wind is, is moving quite well. And that voltage seems to be fluctuating between 13.9, 14 volts. So you can see the amperage. Uh, you can see it much more clear now. Uh, there's probably good, oh, I don't know, uh, maybe 8 amps, 10 amps going on right now. But you can see the system voltage is uh, it's pretty high. So the system's working quite well. I actually saw it earlier. I wish I would have caught it. Uh, that that amperage actually went up to 30 amps, so it was cranking uh, pretty good. And that at that point, the wind was probably maybe blowing 20 miles an hour. I think the turbine is rated at 26 miles an hour at one kilowatt. So um, you figure at 12 miles an hour, I'm gonna get maybe half a kilowatt. Uh, that's why I decided to step it down to 12 volts. It increases the amperage, uh, but it allows me to charge the batteries that are lower. Uh, uh, a lower wind event. So this is actually working quite well for me. Um, wish that uh, you could see it all better, but in, inside the shed it is kind of dark. Um, but she's maintaining pretty well. Right now, after I put the floodlight in, she's not dumping the load anymore. So I'm happy with that. Keep the batteries from uh, boiling too much. And uh, just to give you an idea of the setup right now, there's the uh, refrigerator that's connected to it. There's the, uh, or it's actually a freezer. Uh, and that freezer pulls uh, when it's running 130 watts. So it's not a great big load. Uh, obviously the, uh, that cheap uh, Harbor Freight uh, 1200 watt inverter does pull, pull a load just by using the fans. It's not sophisticated enough to uh, have, uh, you know, load control fans or anything like that. And then uh, I had to put in uh, this 125 watt uh, floodlight uh, just to give it enough uh, uh, of a load so it wouldn't dump out. So it's actually working quite well. Very happy with the Windmax uh, turbine. Uh, once I put the second turbine up, Hopefully this weekend I will shoot a video so we can see both of them in action and uh, to, uh, uh, later on I'll uh, go outside and uh, shoot a video, uh, a video with the uh, single turbine that I have right now. Take care.